One thing that's great about her is through all the press and the paparazzi and through all these horrible things, she's had a great year and she's had some sucky things. She's never once really sunk to any low level. She's always just gone about her life and kind of right. just done her How thing. How do you like the way she dresses, David? She's stunning. <laughs> she's stunning. She, okay. she can go from glam to rocking. Do you great. like my top? You look fabulous and that color is great on you. <laughs> okay, thank you, David. Hey, <laughs> later. David Meister is considered the maestro of fashion mavens, plus the king of the red carpet. No one can put a dress on and rock it like Sharon Stone. You know, Viola Davis, I dress a lot. And you talk, she has a smoking body. If you look good and feel good, you're gonna project confidence. It's really becoming more about a little bit of flirtiness as we go into the season. You really understand a woman's body. I love the element of softness again you bring to it. And I think that's so important when you're presenting your work. So amazing job, everyone, but Madeline, I love it. I think Elizabeth Taylor probably owns the crown for short celebrity marriages. And God knows for the most number. Seven times? you've got Liz Taylor waiting in the bedroom and you're sitting there nursing a scotch at the bar, big problem. Elizabetta, she talk like this. I like Elizabetta, she's sexy. Elizabetta, you are hot, you are sexy, you are amazing, you set my pants on fire. What the hell was he thinking? This hot little Latin bombshell, the perfect little pocket doll. Go anywhere, what more could you want? How's one of my favorite designers? Hi, I'm David. Uh, David Meister is a designer that I've been wearing for the past six years. I have one I think that's really going to be great for you. And this is you look great in the stretch satin. I love, I love your stretch satin. I know you do. My favorite is your I stretch know. satin. And it's love. red and it's sexy and it's red. hot and Ooh. I think it could be great. A little runway fever? Come on, Come on runway fever! <laughs> I like the conversation about Ramona not sharing her designer. I live in David Meister. Everything I wear okay. is David Meister. Darling, I knew who David Meister was before you even knew who She said no, you can't use David Meister. That's my thing. And I'm thinking David Meister's mine too. Right. Her weight was never an issue when we started designing her gown. Designer David Meister with The Insider today. We really wanted to kind of make a combination, a nod to feminine old Hollywood glamour and also be modern and sexy. So, you know, I think we did that very well. A wedding day emergency kit. First, it would be two Valium, one clonazepam. Oh! If you gotta open your wallet at a wedding, come on. Like, oh, that would be four or fifty, sir. I'm like, no. Wedding? Do they make people horny? That's a scary thought. If anything, you'd think it would kill it. If you can't control your bladder for that period of time, you have got much bigger issues, and if I was the one marrying you, I would run. <laughs> if you have a dress that calls for commando and you need a diaper, I don't know. Get a cork. I'm going to show you some of my hottest red carpet looks for spring 2011. And these looks not only work great on the red carpet for celebrities, but they can also work for you in your personal wardrobe as well. And if you've got a great booty back here, depending on how you fit the dress, you can really show it off. And it really accentuates the women's curves, shows off your tiny waist. The thing that I find ironic is the fact, you know, the internet is stealing so much business away from the magazines at this point. And a magazine is actually picking someone from the internet as their man of the year. I think there's something a little ironic That's there. Interesting. Why do you think they do that? They want to get those people to want to read their magazine. Yeah, and I think, again, the younger demographic is absolutely true. You know, I'm all for a little man emotion, but this is crazy. It's like Senate floor, slippery when wet. I mean, of all the things we could be crying over, and of all the real issues to cry over in this country, the things that they're crying over, it's like, That's come on, guys, suck yeah. it up.